welcome to your faith to go. So I talked about how much fun camp is and how meaningful it is, but I kind of wanted to, and most of the time we talk about the kids that go, because it's all the way from like second and third grade through high school, but uh, I got to go as a counselor, I got to be a director one time, and normally I do really little bitty kid camp, uh, and it's wonderful. And it's amazing the kind of insights those kids have, because one of the things that happens across the board at all the camps is at the end of the day, there's always vigils. Um, there's a way and a place to go worship. Now, sometimes that worship is organized by the adults and the counselors, but a lot of times it's organized by the campers themselves. And uh, they learn to take ownership of worship, which is kind of what's gonna happen this Sunday. And, you know, it's not always smooth. It's not always, it doesn't always go the way that they expect. But I've never once been to one of those services, whether they've been led by teenagers or third graders, where God has not shown up, where God has not been so clearly present in that place. And I think we have ideas of the kind of spaces or ways of worship that God shows up in, but um, if we truly believe what Jesus tells us, that it'll be children like these who can show us the kingdom in ways no one else can, then we need to show up when they are offering us worship, when they are showing us the way that they do it. And that's part of what's happening this Sunday, is showing up for our young people, um, showing up for our children and our youth and saying that you are essential to the church. We wanna lift up and celebrate uh, the places where you find meaning, where you encounter God, uh, in unique ways, but it's also an invitation to adults who have never experienced camp. Um, if that's never been something that you have experienced, just like it was brand new to me when I started in ministry, um, it's a way to spend time with God, with nature, with some wonderful campers and other counselors and people who love camp, and uh, discover God in ways maybe you have never discovered God. Um, whether that is on the, you know, the walk to Vespers or after campfire or sitting around the, the lunch table just talking about what happened in small group um, or after morning watch where you just get some quiet reflective time. You know, to think about when was the last time you spent four or five, six days and your whole purpose was spending time with God and with other people who loved God um, with no other purpose. Uh, than that. So uh, camp is a lot of fun and Camp Sunday is going to be a whole lot of fun, but uh, just because we're having fun doesn't mean we're not also doing something really meaningful and something that matters and maybe in ways that God might surprise us uh, with how meaningful and powerful it can be. So I encourage you to join us in person, to worship with us online, uh, but to get yourself there and to support this wonderful ministry and this wonderful uh, worship service that we're gonna offer as a way of kind of kicking off uh, the fun of Eastertide before we start our next uh, sermon series uh, about the people who were the first disciples, were the first resurrection and Easter people and discovering how well do we really know them and how do we see ourselves in their stories and how we can also be Easter and resurrection people going into this season of celebration of the fact that Jesus really is alive. So as always, let's go to God in prayer. God, you can be found in so many places and so many ways. Open our hearts and our eyes to see you all around us. To know that you are in the depths of your creation, seeking us out, always wanting to be in relationship with us, delighting in us and hoping that we will delight in you in both the meaningful and in the fun spaces of our lives. Help us to continue to celebrate the good news of your son who has been resurrected, who has risen from the dead to show us that death does not get the last word. You always do. So we ask this in your holy, holy name. Amen. As always, my friends, be well, be safe, be ready to celebrate camp this Sunday.